Hi, uh, my name is Gerald Schell. I'm a neurosurgeon at Saginaw Valley Neurosurgery. Uh, kyphoplasty is a procedure which is now used to correct the deformities from osteoporotic compression fractures. Um, osteoporosis is one of the most common causes for fractures in people, more common in women, um, postmenopausal women. Um, it can create uh, problems where a person develops a kyphotic posture where they're more stooped and if there's a, more of a stooped posture and there's pain with, the, with this fracture, um, this technology allows us to um, restore the height of the fracture and decrease the pain. The uh, reason to perform a kyphoplasty would be severe pain uh, in the spine where there has been a uh, crack of the inner uh, uh, strength of the vertebrae and it's, this has created an angulation of the spine. This procedure is done through needles. There's no, there's no major um, incision on this and once the kyphoplasty is done there's an instant pain relief and activities the return to activities should be immediate to normal activities. The, um, during a kyphoplasty, uh, we uh, uh, put, the, put you asleep and the procedure normally takes between 20 minutes and a half an hour. Um, we use x-ray guidance to place needles into the fractured uh, bone and once we're inside the fractured bone, we uh, place balloons or OptiMesh bags within the fracture and if it's, we're using uh, the balloon uh, kyphon strategy for kyphoplasty, we will then uh, inflate balloons which will restore the height of the broken bone, deflate the balloon and then insert a cement which will instantly seal inside the bone and during the sealing process usually destroys the nerves which create pain. Um, in the OptiMesh bag where it's called vertebral augmentation which is utilized for the same condition Instead of a balloon being placed within the body, we place a, a mesh, nylon mesh bag and we fill that up with the bone. And by filling that up with the bone, it corrects the height of the fracture and reduces the pain. Both procedures are done through a needle. Both situations are done in outpatient facilities and activities should return to normal almost immediately. Um, usually uh, the recovery is, is very little. There's little tissue trauma. There's internal restoration of the height of the vertebral body, so the recovery should be immediate. If you think you need this procedure, set up an appointment with your primary doctor who can refer you to Saginaw Valley Neurosurgery using this website. If you have any more questions about your procedure, you can click on contact button just above me to the right where you can write an email to our staff or call us at the number listed. Thank you and we look forward to taking care of you here at Saginaw Valley Neurosurgery.